Good morning, everybody. A cold, chilly day here in June. We're here at the uh, Tumwater Falls, which is going a little crazy here still. Um, I had to come back to town, actually, because I have a very large item to pick up. There, It's being held at the post office. Um, and I'm really excited about what we're going to do in Miranda today. So, yeah, let me go downtown with the RV and then I'll show you what's going on, okay? All right. Uh, but first, stopped up here on the west side at the Goodwill here. <laughs> Be dropping off old Blue here at, uh, at the donation box out here. Um, she's been great, but it's time to move on. So, circle of life. She goes back. She'll be available here uh, in West Olympia Goodwill if anybody wants Old Blue here. All right, so those boxes were a little heavier than I expected. Uh, I had to change things up a little bit because they won't even fit through the door. I should have known I'm having a full recliner love seat shipped to me from Amazon, so um, I just did not plan that very well. So now I'm at a friend's house where the boxes are at. I'm going to take them apart in his backyard and bring the couch in piece by piece and set it up here for you, okay? It's going to go in this space right here on the slide out where that old crummy couch was and where my blue recliner used to be to face my 60 inch TV right here. I got the toffee color, which will match the existing toffee vinyl scheme thing everywhere in the carpet and stuff. So let me clear this area. And then we'll go take a look at the new recliner couch sofa. Also, so let's see. I opted out of the power recliner version that uh, Brian from RV with Tito has up north here, actually in Washington State. He got the power version of what I got. To save $300, I mean, I kind of valued it like this. I don't really need power recliners. If you've ever been to those movie theaters where you push button to recline and come back, it's really slow. It's another motor that can go out on you and have problems. And it has the USB ports built into the cup holders. So I have a power outlet right next to where I'm gonna put the couch that already has USB ports and power outlets. So again, to save $300, yet this is still a $1,000 uh, couch, so it's not cheap, but it might be the biggest upgrade that I've made in the RV, except for solar, this may be the biggest one. So let me show you how they package it. So we have three boxes here. Let me put my hand on this box. You can get it, idea. it is monstrous. No, this will not fit through my RV door. And I have two of these huge boxes. There's the company, Rec Pro, in case you're interested. They are very popular for RV swap outs. There's the one I have right there, actually. So we got that one. And then we have one more small package over here. So I started unpacking them and I'm actually really happy with the material. It's, I think it's fake leather anyway, but this one is, I think 21 inches wide. So we are not gonna be too wide to fit through the door with this piece. And they put them in a nice, a nice bag. There's another part of the couch, so. Anyways, I'll set the camera up in the RV and start piecing this thing together. Is that working? I know it may seem like there is not a method to my madness, but I can assure you most of the things I do in my RV, and I'm getting really excited about how things are going with this RV, most of those things have to happen in stages. Okay, so getting the 60 inch LED LG TV there was part of it. And it was always my intention after I removed the couch here to put in a comfy recliner love seat, even though it looks like Jax is gonna enjoy his own seat and all enjoying mine. Uh, these recliners need zero wall. The powered ones actually need four inches to fully recline, but this one do does not need any extra to recline fully. All you do is pull this cord on the side, 
pops out the recliner part. And then, uh, kick back and enjoy the show. Do you like the show, Jax? Is this a good show? Yeah, there might be some, some birdies on here later. Look, there's a penguin, a baby penguin. You like him? Okay. I'll put some links in the video description on uh, Amazon where I got this couch and the TV if you're interested. And you guys saw how I put that together. I'm still, I'm still loving it. It's finally working. I just got to clean up and organize a little bit. I want to find a home for the truck and the speaker and the lamp. Of course, I want to set that up and everything. But Jack's now. See you in our next video. Bye, guys.